The government of Grenada is working with the European Union and the Pan American Health Organization to address health care in relation to non-communicable diseases. The project is titled Enhancing Health Systems Resilience in Grenada to Mitigate the Impact of the COVID-19 Pandemic and Prepare for Future Health Emergencies. A foot care program was launched on Friday and a donation of equipment that will be donated to health centers was handed over to the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Religious Affairs. They include 10 foot care kits, 7 Doppler ultrasound machines and 50 tablets were provided. Other activities under the project which started in July include theoretical and practical training sessions, pharmaceutical supply chain management and others. The EU has given support to the program with half of a million dollars. Project officer at the EU to Barbados, Ms. Janine Blanchard, said the EU is happy to help fill the gap that the pandemic has presented in healthcare delivery. The food care program is one of four parts of the Enhancing Health System Resilience Program. And we understand that during the worst of the pandemic and before vaccines were available, that interruptions in routine health service delivery occurred. As we are now past the acute phase of the COVID-19 pandemic, we are pleased that the health promotion at, beyond the pandemic continues with efforts to address issues at the community level with a renewed focus as there is less emphasis on prevention of spread of infection and a less acute response to the pandemic. The foot care program aims to ensure that the foot health related to chronic conditions such as hypertension and circulatory problems can be monitored in places where persons being served are comfortable. Ms. Fiona Anthony is PAHO's program specialist in Grenada. She said the organization is always delighted to assist the healthcare sector in Grenada. We are therefore pleased to collaborate with the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Religious Affairs and the European Union on this most relevant training as the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Religious Affairs seeks to address anecdotal reports of rising prevalence of secondary complications of chronic diseases in patients with reduced utilization of the healthcare services during COVID-19. Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Religious Affairs, Ms. Naomi Jeremiah, said through training and other initiatives, health teams across the Tri-Island State will be strengthened. Today I'm indeed happy and Pledge, I extend my congratulations to a job well done by the Ministry of Health for making this initiative here a grand success. I would like to urge the population to note that the Ministry of Health mandate for this new 2023 era, 22-25, is revitalizing, energizing the primary health teams and community involvement. So this other fair food care program will be part of the education that will be going around, empowering the community, empowering people, and letting everybody be involved in such knowledge so that we can have a healthy Grenada where we can put amputation out of the state of our trial land. 